I recently sent in samples of two trees that I thought could be survivor American chestnut trees, and I finally got my results back. I sent them into the Pennsylvania slash New Jersey chapter of the American Chestnut Foundation at Penn State, and they were both determined to be American chestnuts. Now, if you remember, the one tree was about 50 feet tall and was producing nuts. So I went back to the trees to see if I could collect any of the nuts that yeah. the tree was producing. I scoured the surrounding area under a ground cover of English ivy and found about 20 fruits that dropped to the ground. And unfortunately though, when I opened them up, all of the nuts except for one were undeveloped or unpollinated. This makes sense because while the American chestnut is considered self-compatible, the male and female flowers typically bloom at different times on the same tree so they very rarely pollinate themselves. The good news is that I found a single fertilized nut that looks viable. There is also still a good amount of fruit left on the tree, so I plan to go back over the next few weeks to see if I can find any more viable nuts.